so shall we ever be with the Lord. You are going to vindicate. That's your position. That's who you are. You're not a carrier, but this body will be united and will resurrect just as the original seed did. I want the song sung tonight. They're going to sing for you. Are you she? You can go and start. I just want you to listen to this. I've listened to it about 18,000 times. I am she. You can go along and sing it. Go ahead. Need the microphone. Amen. 
can imagine. You can stand. I can imagine if they're coming as you cross the gates of Pearl and they say, oh, oh, uh, what's your name? Michael. Michael. Are, are you, did you come from that last age? You, did, you just seem to walk in. Are you one from that last age? You, are you serious? You are one that crossed through the darkest tower? Yes. You are that one? You yes. came from Laodicea? The most perverted age? Hey, Daniel, Joseph, come and look. This is one of them that crossed over. Like, what's your name? You also crossed through that dark tower? You received the message of that air? Oh, my goodness. Come, Esther, Ruth, look at this one. This is she, the bride of the last day that came through the darkest tower. If they're going to be that excited, what about you? You say, yes, that's me. I did it. The darkest time, the wickedest time. I made it. I crossed through. That's me. I went through depression. I went through anxiety. I went through dark time. It's me. I am she. I'm the original seed. I didn't go through that carrier age. But then you'll say back to them, but the life came through you. You will live true to the word of your dower. You were pressured. You went through dark times. Yeah, we did too. Where else? Where can I see? Who else came? Oh, here's a martyr that came with me. Oh, here's another one that went through the lines. Oh, my goodness. Can I talk to you a little bit? We're together. We're the bride. We're the whole body. It's every single one, every joint supply. I can't wait for that moment. You see, this is us. They're waiting for you and I. They're waiting for you and I. The final ones. The last day. Just hold it a little longer. Get fervent a little more. I read a quote today by Abraham. It says, we just need to be more sincere and more solemnity. I said, oh God, help me be more sincere so that you can move through this body, through this vessel. I want you to sing with them now as we close. You are she. Hey Amen, we'll sing the chorus. Yes, sir. The pride of the last day. I'm walking out here. I hope that song just rings through the anthems of your mind over and over and over because that's just a confession you put on your lips because the devil's going to go at you as you walk out them doors right there and he's going to start feeding you all the difficulties of tomorrow and all the past of today but you're like that don't matter because I'm she. I'm this bride of this last day and the worst you can give me devil you can even lay me on a cold slab and throw me in a morgue but the seed inside of me is going to go into glory so I don't really care what you do. What's the worst he can do? Kill you? Well, he just put you into glory. All right. My time's up. That's the safety and the comfort of a believer. Oh, but that's a quivering place for an unbeliever or a make-believer. Now, if you can't walk out of these doors with that confidence, then maybe your place is at an altar. Maybe it's at a pew. 
but the bride can say that's me amen heavenly father lord all